diaspora. Let us recognize that cricket is a global game, and whether it is in Rwanda or Kenya, that we need to be able to have more people playing cricket, and the Caribbean can continue to bring our prowess there to be able to have the benefit of more cricket playing nations out of Africa and the African diaspora. Can cricket strengthen the bonds between Africa and the Caribbean? In the Caribbean, cricket is not just a sport. In the 20th century struggle against British domination, cricket was central to the Caribbean's anti-colonial independence project. International cricket is also viewed as a way out of poverty. Originally introduced by British colonizers in the 19th century as an exclusively white male-dominated imperial sport, cricket quickly drew Afro-Caribbean players. Afro-Caribbeans were allowed to join the West Indies cricket team in 1900, and by the 1940s they were numerically dominant. In 1960, an Afro-Caribbean man, Frank Worrell, became the first black captain of the West Indies cricket team. Caribbean cricket narratives and histories tend to focus on the sport's association with anti-colonial resistance and the efflorescence of a unified West Indian consciousness against the white planter class, what's often called liberation cricket. But contemporary Caribbean cricket is something quite different. Over the past two decades, globalization and commercialization of the sport have largely undone its political underpinnings. Badri, you can't keep him out of the game. Go on, go on. There's a moment you just said he's not picking him. But looked a good shot, but might go straight to the field, it does. And there's the Bravo Jig. The big man Brathwaite has got an important wicket there. Yeah. Up in the air, should be gone, it is gone. Slower ball bouncer does the trick for Stokes, the dancing begins. Oh, glove is it down the leg side, yes, gone. Nick down the leg side, Bravo has another. Will it carry? It does carry. And it's root. He hasn't hit this well enough. Johnson Charles. Well, he misjudged it initially. But he's managed to hold on. Oh, brilliant. Brilliant from Samuel Badri. Gone a long way up and the plan could work. Mid on sets himself. It's Joe Root, would you believe it? He's hit that one. He could be gone again. He is gone again. Oh, is that going down or is it out? It's out. It's really, it's three. Fifty for Marlon Samuels. Yet again in a final, he delivers. Oh, up in the air, should be taken, is taken, it's hard, has that been taken, it has, who else, Ben Stokes, what a fielder he is, up and over the offside, another catch, taken again, it's Willie again, oh, he did to the leg side, oh, West Indies, that helps, Oh, big shot, huge shot, where's he gone? Into the stands! Oh, it's hard.